what you've done for me. Thank you, Lord, for what you're doing now. Thank you, Lord, for everything. Matt here, on farm ideas. And today, I wanted to uh, talk to you a little bit about uh, runners. Um, you want to avoid runners um, if you're trying to grow your uh, strawberry plant, like the uh, main plant. You want to avoid runners. Um, what runners basically do is, um, well, here's I already cut those two off, but here's one that's actually shooting out from this strawberry plant. Okay, and what they do is they're trying to propagate. They're trying to basically, you know, stretch their arms out and, uh, you know, plant themselves in different areas. And uh, that in itself is not a bad thing other than um, if you want to put energy into your actual strawberry plant and into fruiting, you need to make sure that these aren't shooting off everywhere. Um, I waited a while to cut this one, and I haven't, I haven't uh, pruned mine yet, but... Anyway, this is basically the pruning you would want to do. See how long that is? Now, you, uh, if you watch my last video, you could see that you could actually put this down into a pot, this area right here, and a root will pop out of there. And then you can just clip it once it gets rooted in a pot. You can just clip that, this piece, cut it right here, and you'll have another tomato plant or a strawberry plant. But this is taking up energy from this actual uh, strawberry plant. So. What you basically want to do is you want to kind of follow it down. Let's see if I can do this. Okay. You basically want to follow it down to the, you know, close close to the root or close to the ground as, as close as you can get it. And then just clip that. Okay. You want to clip all the runners. <laughs> like tomatoes, you want to clip off any suckers that are going to, you know, take energy from your plant. So let's see if we have any more. Uh, nothing sticking out, really. Oh, there's one. See? That thing, and you could tell them, too, by, uh, you know, the ends usually, um, there, there'll be an elbow at the end here. It'll, you know, a little, little elbow, and it usually wants to stick to the ground like that, and then it plants itself. So you want to take those off. So let's take this last one off here. So I'm basically cutting off the runners to put energy into all the strawberry plants to actually grow uh, more greens there and then also to start fruiting. Okay, so that's how you want to cut off the runners and why you want to cut off, cut off the runners. You don't want uh, if you don't want them moving around, and you want them getting bushy, um, and as you can see, I don't need them moving around. I got plenty of room for these to grow in, um, so I don't really want them running everywhere. So I'm just going to cut those off. It's going to put energy back into the growth of the plant and also uh, producing strawberries. So, anyways, hopefully that helps you guys. Um, come join us on uh, Facebook at facebook.com forward slash home farm ideas. And uh, make sure to subscribe, post any of your comments below, and I uh, hope that helps you guys. So anyways, God bless.